James DeSantis, Garrett McGee, and Melissa Brazer, welcome to DBL. You three are sought after by celebrities and Bravo liberties alike. Is there any celeb projects you've got in the works right now? We're actually going to be working with Bobby Burke um, yes. of Queer Eye, and we're helping with the design of the exterior spaces for that. So it's in the early stages, but it's going to be a really good collab, you know, two TV designers together. He's so fun. Too. He's yeah. the best. All right, I am designing my patio right now. It's my first house I've ever had. James, what advice do you have for anyone thinking of just beginning to redesign their patio or backyard? Um, we always say to start small, like stay close to the house so that you are, you know, utilizing the spaces that you're going to go to the most. We always say also, like, you don't need to have like a huge green lawn. So we sometimes sort of chop the lawn up a little bit and add in hardscaping or some type of decking because it's just easier to maximize your use um, of a space if it's not such a large green open space. That's smart. All right, Melissa, let's say I have, let's say a very small balcony, like a very small space. What are some staples I could get to really spruce up that area? Well, in a really small space, um, we can't skimp on the green just because there's not a lot of floor space. Um, so use the vertical walls. You can use a trellis system. Oh, yeah. You can use um, hanging planters. You can create your own green wall um, and then maybe have one large statement pot um, to ground the space a bit. Um, and then maybe a bistro chair and table, and then you have a home office, a place for coffee, um, a place to have a private romantic dinner. So there's a lot of space, a lot of uses in a small space. That's smart. Make Think height, think upwards when you have a balcony. That's very smart. Garrett, once we're inside the house, what are some of your secrets for caring for indoor house plants? I have kept two plants alive. They're still doing okay, but I'm going for it. Well, my number one tip that I always say is get on a watering schedule because the number one way that people actually kill plants is not from underwatering, it's usually from overwatering. Over yeah. Water once a week, make sure they're not sitting in water because that's how they'll get root rot and die immediately. And then other than that, I like to make sure that I'm talking to my plants yeah. and just checking on, you know, just make sure they're happy. So I have hydrangeas that I just put in and I talk to them and I go, <coughs> you're thirsty little ones. It's very, very weird. Yeah, uh, very strange. All right. For, for, it happens. It, it, I think it helps. So from caring for plants to plants that care for you, Garrett, are there any health benefits for plants? So sometimes we'll plant herbs that you can use in your food, things like echinacea, which also has an herbal remedy to it. So we're always thinking in that kind of way. And also just having plants around you purifies the air and just makes it overall your well-being just nicer. Backyard Envy is now on Bravo. James DeSantis, Garrett McGee, and Melissa Brazer. You guys are super cute and amazing. I'll be watching. Thanks for chatting and thank you for stopping by.